Good morning everybody, hope you guys are doing good in the hood. Sorry I look a bit messy, I gotta trim and all that. But today, I'm gonna do something really interesting. So guys, I like my coffee really good in the morning. It's like the most important thing in the day. I made a coffee, okay? Added some sugar, artificial sugar. And my coffee, I love it big, so this is like a soup cup. Don't judge me, that's what I like. This is what I gotta do. And this is my machine, coffee machine. I just added the, I just opened the frother right here. And this is the crazy part. All right guys, so look, this is an egg. Crack it open. Again, don't judge me on what I'm about to do. Because this really tastes good. I tried it the first time and that's why I'm showing it to you today. Get an empty bottle. Okay. Squeeze it. And let it go in. It's okay if there's a little jelly with it. Makes a nice flavor. This you can do something with it if you want. But first you gotta get another one or you know empty it out somewhere. Throw this thing in again. Come on, baby. Go out. There we go. This white stuff is okay. Open the frother or anything. If you don't have a coffee machine, you can use like a steer, you know, one of these. You can use one of these. Just stir it very well. Once you do it, pour it in the coffee. It's like better if it's foamy. This didn't become a foamy part because I didn't stir it enough, which is okay because I'm gonna stir it. Like, I'm gonna put the whole coffee in like the same machine to make it even better. And there you have it really nice foamy coffee. What I like doing is I like to add a few other stuff vanilla. Cinnamon and chocolate. Don't add a lot of cinnamon because cinnamon is really strong. So just make a nice little drop. For vanilla as well because it has a really strong taste. Just like pancakes. When you're doing pancakes, don't put too much. And chocolate. And again, you can do it with a frother or something else. Let's do it with this now. And hola, you got the tastiest coffee ever. Better than Starbucks, better than McDonald's, better than anything else. Just try it, you know. Try doing new stuff and taste them. A lot of people told me you're crazy when I did this egg coffee. But it's an actual thing that Taiwanese coffee has egg. So you can check it on Google, uh, on YouTube as well. But I recommend this because this is really, really good. Just try it. There's nothing to lose. But be careful when you're um, when you're putting the the egg yolk in the frother. Be careful because sometimes it could cook up. This is too hot, so you need to make it quick. You know, not take your time because it could cook some stuff, and it's bad for this as well. So make sure that you know you take care of that. 
So it's all good. Take care. Hope you enjoyed this. And please, 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 if you've tried this, if you've done it, please comment back and tell the other people what you think, like a review. Because to be honest, I love this. And when I say I love it, I mean, I would drink it, of course. It's just amazing. It, ha it makes you have that creamy taste of the... You don't taste the eggs, especially when you put so many other stuff in it. But egg is good, you know. It gives you the proteins that you need. So, yeah. Take care, peace, and let me know. Please comment below and like this if you liked it, if you actually tried it and liked it. And dislike it if you actually tried it and disliked the coffee. So we can know, you know, it will be a review for other people. So we help others and they help us and it's quite interesting. So take care. See you guys later. Peace.